Hey what's up guys welcome to Lara Tips. In today's video I'll be showing you the difference between when and if and I'll show you exactly how much time will it take to process 100,000 data using when and if. If you guys don't know that using if like this if user type is admin and user when user type is admin it is both the same thing now let's see how much time it will take if we are using if and how much will it take whenever we use when i'll show you the exact time in the spreadsheet so here guys i have made a spreadsheet i'll write here how many times it took when we are using if and i'll write here how many time it took when using when then here guys we'll just divide when by normal and it will show me how much faster or slower this when is whenever we are dividing this normally by when so now let's move directly into it so just before doing that let me show you guys we are creating a user factory over here like this and now let me do here dd and let me say normal if so just checking whether it goes inside this if statement or not okay now let me run this test and you can see here guys i can see here normal test okay now if i just go inside this and if i say here when like this and if i rerun the test now you can see here guys it has gone inside this when as well which means that these two are the same thing now to check the performance difference between this normal if statement and when let us assign a micro time to the start and we'll do some operations after this and again we'll record the same micro time and we'll just look at the difference and it will give us the time in seconds so we have set micro time to the start after that we'll go through for each loop and here guys we'll go through 100000 records okay whenever we do range 1 comma 100000 then it will loop 100000 times and guys from php8 we can just separate this number with underscore and it will just ignore this underscore if you don't know about that then it's a tip for you guys and then we'll check the if and when here and after that we'll just dd the current micro time minus the start time this time so now it will give us the difference in seconds okay now let me remove this and first of all let us check this if we are simply just writing this if statement in between the for each we are not doing any operations and with this we can know exactly how long will this normal if statement take or this when will take whenever we are looping through 100,000 records okay now let me run this test okay now you can see here guys it is taking this much seconds and let me just copy this and paste it over here like this okay and let me rerun this test and I'll run this test three times for each I'll add it over here and again guys let me again run this test and I'll copy this and I'll paste it over here now let me comment this normal if statement and let me just uncomment this one and let me run this test again and you can already see guys it took more than one second when we are using only normal if statement then it took only fraction of a second but it is taking already more than one second it is almost two seconds guys so let me just copy this and paste it over here now you can see here guys it was 11 times slower this coin was 11 times slower than that of the normal if statement now let us also perform these operations two more times and this here it will give us the average so let me rerun this test let me copy it one more time and let me paste it over here it was a little bit faster now and again let us run this test one more time and this is the final time that i am testing guys i will not take more of your time so here i am just pasting it and you can see here guys there is a difference so i am only doing it three times but you can just perform this operation 10 times or 100 times and you can test it out now guys if you look here in the average if you look here i am just summing this three and dividing by three over here so with the three tests we can for sure say that normal if statement is much more faster than using when and you can see here guys in an average it is 7.5 times slower this when is 7.5 times slower than that of the normal if statement so guys whenever you are using this when in a loop then you must think it 
twice wherever you can use this normal if statement just use it don't go for when statement so i hope you enjoyed this video guys if you want to see more performance related videos like this then just let me know in the comment section below and i'll be doing more videos like this thank you for watching have a great day bye